Thursday's Fifth Harmony, and that's my girl. And this is Radio One. This is BBC Radio One. It's probably the most talked about, most watched viral video in the world this week. It is a polar bear on the ice who keeps falling over again and again and again. Well, we've managed to track someone down from the people who originally made that advert, White Bear Mitsubishi in Minnesota, all the way in America. Now, I've not managed to get hold of the polar bear because he's a polar bear. But I do have the next best thing, the actual human in the video, Richard. Hi, Richard. Hey, man. How are you, sir? Pretty good, thank you. I love that you call me Sir Richard. I shall call you Sir as well. Uh, sir Richard, you have taken the internet Hello. by storm in the last couple of days. It must be very strange for you uh, having so many people get joy from your video. Yeah, I mean, I really have no... Uh, I, it was completely unexpected. We have no idea how it happened. We've been showing it to everyone. I keep showing it to people. And I love seeing someone's reaction to it who's never watched it before. We um, we showed it to a girl called Steph the other day. This, Richard, was her reaction. <laughs> she could not contain herself, Richard. Oh, my goodness. That makes me smile. It's, uh, I remember the first time I watched and I laughed so hard, I started crying. So, I mean, that... When I saw the proof of the outtake video, I thought, OK, we definitely have to put this on Facebook. So. Yeah, it is absolutely amazing. Um, now, we, we're in, very intrigued by the bear. Can anyone speak to the bear? Uh, well, the bear has a non-speaking role at our dealership. The uh, obviously mascot stay in character. And what's funny is during the commercial shoot, both the gopher and the bear stayed in character the entire time. I mean, they didn't speak. They didn't make noises. Hang on a second. So when the bear went down and hit his face, he he didn't go, ow, my face. He just stayed in character and was entirely silent. He did. I mean, you look at, I mean, even when he fell down the one time, but he didn't fall, you can see him express his frustration just by slamming his you know, his hands down by his sides. Now, here's the thing, Richard. I, I believe that you maybe have different feelings about this because you were there on the day and all you're trying to do is get through the, the day's work. You've got a job, you've got your lines to say, and this guy next to you keeps falling over. Were you getting a bit annoyed at the time? Oh, not at all. I mean, what was happening was every time he fell, um, we just kept laughing. And then at the end, you know, when I put my hand on his back, you know, when he did that huge face plant... All of us were looking like, is he okay? Is he dead? Because that was a pretty, it was a pretty hard fall. Presumably, the guy inside is uh, is doing absolutely fine. Yeah, actually, no no bears or humans were harmed in the uh, making of our commercial. So, why was the white bear falling over quite so much? The way our mascot was built, the bottoms or the soles of his feet are actually like sandals. So, if you can imagine walking on smooth ice with sandals. I mean, the bear has so, now become a legitimate celebrity in its own right, Richard. Um, do you fear... Well, I don't know if I call him a celebrity, he might be a bear liberty. He's a bear liberty. Um, do you fear that the fame is going to go to his head? I don't think so. I, the white bear is very down to earth. Um, and so I think, you know, we'll be able to make some more bear and gopher commercials. Well, do pass on my regards to the bear and also to the gopher who was there playing a less hilarious but still important role in the video. Um, and, <laughs> and and thank both of them for bringing joy to me and to lots of people, including the ones I've shown the video to. That's amazing. Thank you so much. Richard, it was lovely to talk to you. I can't wait for the next video. Cheers, mate. All right, cheers. The FA Cup on the BBC.